rapid growth of Indian economy has resulted into exponential growth of motor vehicles. This has created two problems. The first problem is of the bulging of the oil import bill. The government of India will be burdened to the tune of 290 billion US dollars by 2020, a major drain of foreign exchange. The second problem is about raising level of pollution. 13 Indian cities have been identified among the top 20 most polluted cities in the world. The Government of India has identified that the electric vehicles can solve both these problems. According to Mr. Tony Seba, Professor of Stanford University, California, the automobile industry is going to have a disruptive change. By 2030, all cars are going to be electric. The Hyderabad-based Axiom Group realized the importance of electric vehicles and made a foray into EV component manufacturing in the year 2008. This business has been spun off into a separate company called Axiom EV Products Private Limited in March 2015. The products manufactured are EV battery chargers, EV motor controllers and EV DC to DC converters. Axiom is the leading supplier of EV components for electric three-wheeler, capturing 65% of market share. Axiom EV Products Private Limited has a dedicated state-of-the-art manufacturing facility in Hyderabad. It has fully automatic SMT lines, automatic test equipment, regenerative aging chambers, environmental chambers and automatic motor controller test setups. The company has tied up with a few major auto companies in the country in order to supply products for their upcoming four-wheelers. The Axiom Group has a strong corporate clientele. Axiom EV Products Private Limited is a subsidiary of Axiom Energy Conversion Limited established in the year 1997. The parent company specializes in the manufacturing of power conversion products. The parent company is a leading supplier of AC to DC adapters and chargers in the country. These products are supplied to water purifier, TV set dock box and mobile phone industries in the country. Corporate giants like Kent, AquaGuard, Airtel and Hindustan Unilever are prime customers for Axiom's power adapters. Many corporate companies in a water purifier, digital TV setup box and mobile manufacturing companies have exhibited confidence in Axiom products from past 18 years because of our state of our technology and quality. A man behind the success of Axiom Group, Mr. M.J. Purohit, an electronic engineer, had set up Axiom in the year 1997. A strong believer of Japanese culture, Mr. Purohit has undergone training in a Japanese company. Mr. Purohit is supported by a team of 15 senior executives, most of whom are with the company since its inception. One of Axiom Group's core strengths is its R&D. Axiom's R&D is a 50-member strong team with state-of-the-art facilities, including its own product evaluation laboratory, one of its kind in the country. All the products manufactured by Axiom Group are developed by its own R&D. Many of the products are certified by national and international agencies like TUV, CE and ISI. Right from the inception, the Axiom Group established manufacturing facilities and systems in line with international standards. Axiom was awarded ISO 9001 in the year 1998, the very second year of operation. Companies' focus on quality infrastructure and quality management system has helped Axiom to achieve its leadership position. Axiom EV Products Private Limited will soon be awarded TS16949 certification. The major strength of Axiom is its employees itself. They are very dedicated, trained and have been associated with Axiom from a very long time, actually since the company's inception itself. Axiom has developed a unique customer-centric culture whereby once a customer buys from Axiom, they will become customers for life. Axiom believes that to retain customers for life, you have to believe in three fundamental principles. Supplying quality product at a reasonable price and providing extremely good service. 
Both Axiom's businesses have entered into a rapid growth phase due to sequence of events which took place for the past few years. In 15 years, our electric vehicle business could be as high as 4 to 5,000 crore. Growth opportunities for EV products business. Huge commercial success of e-rickshaw has opened growth of opportunity. Axiom, being early bird, can capture a major share of the market. Due to bulging of oil import bill and rising pollution, the government is in a tearing hurry to replace oil vehicles with electric ones. Government's mission for electric vehicles has further accelerated this growth. An amount of 23,000 crore rupees has been sanctioned for EV growth. Success of companies like Tesla, Nissan and GM with their electric vehicles has further prompted the other players to follow suit. Electric vehicles are going to be cheaper and better in performance than ICE vehicles by 2018. We at Axiom EV see a very bright future for electric vehicle and electric vehicle components industries. Being a front runner, we see a tremendous scope for our chargers, controllers or DC-DC converters. Growth opportunities for power adapter business. Chinese currency appreciated by 22% while India's rupee depreciated by 25%. Electronic manufacturing moving from China due to a rapid rise in labor cost. China's labor cost is four times more than India. Government of India launched an electronic policy to reduce import and to encourage local manufacturing. 30,000 crore rupees was earmarked for the purpose. With the Make in India program, the government has increased the custom duty on imported electronic goods. It has further accelerated the local manufacturing. More than 10 mobile manufacturing companies have started their local operations. TV set-top boxes which were imported earlier have been indigenized in total. The company also has a huge export opportunity to Europe and the US markets which are being vacated by China. As a result of the above factors, Power Adapters business is flooded with orders and is in need of expansion. Due to the above events, the company is presented with an opportunity to multiply its revenues 15 times by 2020 to a value of 1,000 crore rupees. The company has decided to set up an additional manufacturing facility for power adapter business with an investment of 100 crore rupees at Tirupati in Andhra Pradesh. Whereas, 50 crore rupees expansion facility for EV components is proposed to be set up at Gulbarga in Karnataka.